Hi pals, this week on Goal with the Heat, we finally get our first full episode of Miami Vice about the one and only Trudy Joplin in the episode The Dutch Oven. On this week in Vice, we'll be covering the time when this episode aired from October 20th to October 26th, 1985, when Miami Vice was king. In news, on October 20th, a small group of close friends will say their final goodbye to the legendary Rock Hudson. Starring in over 60 movies in the TV show Dynasty, Rock Hudson died on October 2nd from complications from the AIDS virus. A versatile actor and a heartthrob from the golden age of film, he was the first major celebrity to die from the AIDS virus. In music, at the top of the Hot 100, it's a new week and a new hit. This week, Take On Me by AHA would only hold the top spot for one week, but this is one of the most memorable songs from the 80s. Although it isn't the greatest song, almost everyone knows the music video. The song was originally released in 1984 and received a few revisions until being re-released and finally reaching the charts. 1985 was clearly the year that MTV helped make hits and this music video was made for the MTV generation. In movies, the action film Commando still holds the top spot, but I found a movie release at the same time just for you B-movie fans. Reanimator was released on October 18th. Loosely based on the H.P. Lovecraft novella, the film was about a doctor that unsurprisingly can reanimate the dead. Reanimator was spawned two sequels and a theater musical and still has a large cult following. To me, what makes Reanimator a classic is the practical effects. Whether it's Reanimator or The Thing or Videodrome, I'm a sucker for movies that actually build their effects. And that's everything you need to know that was happening when Miami Vice was king. Be sure to check out our main show at GoWithTheHeat.com. I'd love to hear from you. Email the show at GoWithTheHeat at gmail.com or follow me on Twitter at Dom Corvo. That's all for this week. Bye, pals.